The progressive um, Midas Touch Super PAC featured former um, squatter Donald Trump's father, Fred Trump. Basically, they were criticizing him on Father's Day, which is a very good thing to do. And their, very, and their family business accusing the younger Trump of squandering the Trump Organization fortune. Um, the vehemently anti-Trump Midas Touch political group released its latest blistering attack against the former squatter, his family members, and the Trump Organization on Sunday, which was Father's Day. Um, as part of its ongoing effort to ensure Trump never gets near the White House again, which we don't want him there, the Fred's failure advertisement describes Donald as fraudulent and claims, which is true, he conned and lied his way through several failed business ventures, including Trump University and Trump Stakes. Um, the ad shows Fred quoting Shakespeare and appearing to foresee his son's future business failings. On this Father's Day, let's remember that Fred's uh, that, uh, that at hashtag Fred's failure became America's failure, and we all paid the price. Retweet this far and wide and text it to all your friends. Let's make sure he never gets near the White House again, reads a Midas Touch tweet about the video. Um, Donald inherited his father's millions and lost it. He inherited a boom, booming economy and took less than four years to destroy it. Fred's failure has become America's failure, um, the ad released on Sunday. The former squatter also had politics in his mind this Father's Day weekend, issuing a statement Sunday that blasted some of his favorite critics at Happy Father's Day to all, including the... Even though he called them radical left, but technically the ones that are radical the, are the um, Republicans. The rhinos and other losers of the world. Yeah, he fits right in that category of being a loser. Hopefully, eventually, everyone will come together, um, basically. Um, but Midas touches um, at, at, hash, um, at hashtag Fred's failure. Basically, um, in social media campaigns, seeks to draw in funds for Act Blue and other Democratic-leaning grassroots initiatives. Parts of the video show Fred who founded the Trump Organization back in the 1920s in New York City, and Donald would later take over the business and, and basically fail, and then he would pass on the executive duties down to his own sons who are just as dumb as he is, Donald Trump Jr. and Eric Trump. But what is the secret of your success, the late Fred Trump, who um, had said, um, but even though he died back in 1999, it says he can be heard saying this during a 1980s um, speech about business, 9 out of 10 people don't like what they do. They go from job to job, ultimately becoming nothing. The ad goes on to list several of the former squatters' failed business ventures over the decades, like Trump Stakes, three Trump casinos in Atlantic City, and Trump University, were all called out as a fraudulent. The, ro the roast of Trump and his family continued, citing the New York Attorney General forcing Trump to pay $2 million in 2019 for having misused his own charity funds. And, <clears throat> that's not surprising at all.